And so, really, what this trip was about it was less about containing China. I, I, I don't want to contain China. I just want to make sure we have a relationship with China that is on the up and up, squared away. Everybody knows what it's all about. And one of the ways you do that is you make sure that we are talking about the same things. And uh, I think that one of the things we've done, I've tried to do, and I've talked with a number of my staff about this for the last. I guess six months is we have an opportunity to strengthen alliances around the world to maintain stability. That's what this trip was all about. It's not about containing China. It's about having a stable base, a stable base in the Indo-Pacific. We're not looking to decouple from China. What I'm not going to do is I'm not going to sell China material that would enhance their capacity. To make more nuclear weapons, to engage in defense activities that are contrary to what is viewed as most people think is a positive development in the region, and uh, but we're not trying to hurt China. We have a relationship with China that is on the up and up, squared away, and faster here as we have, and so it seems that we have the economic capacity. What to do about the particular crisis? Progress today builds on. Camp David trilateral with Japan and, and Republic of Korea and the United States. Comprehensive strategic partnership the United States launched with, with ASEAN last year. And the engagement with, Pacific Island, with the Pacific Island Forum. Our strengthened alliances with the Philippines and AUKUS. Partnership with Australia and the United Kingdom. Our elevated quad engagement with India, Australia and Japan. And the Indo-Pacific Economic Framework for Prosperity. And all the effort we've advanced from day one of my administration to demonstrate to our Indo-Pacific partners and the world, the United States is a Pacific nation, and we're not going anywhere. Now, let me also speak to significant business we got done in, in, in India during the G20 summit. This was an important moment for the United States to demonstrate our global leadership and our commitment to solving the challenges that matter most to people around the world.